you know, I think in individual leadership, you are, you know, leaning into your talent and your strength. And there is a lot of autonomy Mm -hmm. in that type of a leadership model. Whereas in collective leadership, obviously, you're leading with others. It's almost like an orchestra, right? Uh, There needs to be this synchronization of all of those talents into a common song. And at the Kellogg Foundation, we learn through some of our own leadership development that we call that direction, alignment, and commitment, Hmm. DAC. Uh, That's a set for creative leadership model. But everyone on the team has to understand what we're pursuing, first of all, and be very clear on what the end looks like. And then once we're clear on the end and we're all committed to achieving that and we're aligned around our values, then the execution can happen more synchronously. And uh, I think that is what we built at the Kellogg Foundation. And it wasn't always that way. It's our learned journey that we've been on as it relates to all of our work. And leadership in particular is something that we believe is part of our DNA. So we've leaned into it. We, yeah. We've really focused on how to develop the best leadership for serving children. 